click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, today we are going to study a new graph that is a unit signal function. Basically, signal function is important. Unit means just the amplitude will be one. This signal function is represented by S G N of T. This was the way to represent that function. How to plot that graph or what is the graph? I'll show you. This graph is available from zero onwards on both these sides, but having amplitude in both the directions. Like for a positive period, it is having amplitude one, whereas for negative period, it is having amplitude minus one. Now, how to write that equation? But in both the cases, most important one is it is having amplitude zero at t equals to zero. At t equals to zero, amplitude is zero, and zero onwards the amplitude is one, and on both these sides, it is having amplitude one and minus one. Now the important one is how to write the equations. So the signal function is represented by S G N of t. You can write this equation in two ways. First of all. For mod of t not equals to zero, this function is represented by two u of t minus one, and for t equals to zero, this amplitude is zero. One more way to write this equation is the signal function is having amplitude one, zero, or minus one, but for t greater than one. It is having amplitude one. For t greater than one, it is having amplitude one. For t is equals to zero, that amplitude is also zero. And for t less than minus one, it is having amplitude minus one. So for t less than minus one, having amplitude minus one. As well as for t equals to one also and t equals to minus one also, the amplitude is one. So we'll write here less greater than equals to and Less than equals to. So we'll conclude. The signal function is mostly used in Fourier transform, and uh, this graph is only available onwards zero, like on both the sides, as well as it is having amplitude plus one also, minus one also, but on positive half cycle and in negative period. Basically, you can write this equation in two ways. It is mentioned over here. It is available. For mod of t when it is not equal to zero, and this is the function, and for t equal to zero, the amplitude is zero. And in second case, the graph for t is greater than equal to one, this amplitude is one, and for t is greater um, less than my equal to one, it is minus one. And for t equal to zero, the amplitude is zero. Thank you for watching these videos. Stay tuned with Ikeda and subscribe Ikeda for next coming videos.